CRYOSAT-1, also known as just Cryosar, was a European Space Agency satellite which was lost in a launch failure in 2005. It was to have been operated as part of the Cryosar program to study the Earth's polar ice caps. The Cryosar spacecraft was intended to operate in low Earth orbit for three years. It had a mass of 750 kg (1,650 pounds). Its primary instrument, Synthetic Aperture Interferometric Radar Altimeter was to have used radar altimeter to determine and monitor the spacecraft's altitude in order to measure the elevation of the ice, and for radar imaging of the ice caps. A second instrument, DORIS, was to have been used to calculate precisely the spacecraft's orbit. It also carried an array of retroreflectors which would have allowed measurements to be made from the ground to verify the orbital data provided by Doris. Cryosar was launched from Site 133 thirds at the Plesisk Cosmodrome at 15 hours 2 minutes and 0 seconds Coordinated Universal Time on 8 October 2005. The launch was conducted by Euroco, using a rocket carrier rocket with a Briz KM upper stage. The command to shut down the rocket's second stage engine was missing from the flight control system, and consequently the stage burned to depletion. This prevented the second stage from separating from the Briz KM, and as a result the rocket was unable to achieve orbit. It re-entered over the Arctic Ocean, north of Greenland. A replacement satellite, CRYOSAT-2, was successfully launched in 2010. <laughs> 